today's morning here. Um, plane ride has been really, really good so far. And then about probably an hour or less from our destination, um, we had to stop in Madrid to get some gas. So our plane ran out of gas after coming over the pond. And um, <laughs> we're in Madrid now, fueling up. Um, so definitely that's been a fun experience. Stopped and was able to stretch. And hopefully, I think it's only about another 45 minutes until we get to Barcelona. Um, but we think we are all going to for sure take a good nap before we do any adventures today because it's morning here, but it's still probably like 2 a.m. back home. Um, so that we're nice and rested. We're hopefully going to get to the hotel and take a little nappy poo. But um, yeah, that's been our ride so far. We had dinner um, like an hour and a half after we departed, um, which was pretty good. They had some options. I got like the pasta um, that was delicious. And then we just had like a little quick breakfast um, because like I said, it's morning where we are. So um, it's been a good successful plane ride. Stopping to the gas and then we'll be on our merry way. Good morning again. So we uh, are the, we made it to Barcelona safely. Um, we are here. You may be wondering, where are we? Are we on our way to our hotel? No, we're on our way to the terminal. So because we got here so late, I guess they didn't have a gate for us to um, get off. And um, yeah, we had stopped in the middle of the tarmac, and they are busing us to the terminal. So not an easy process but hopefully this uh, you know goes a little bit faster we get our bags fast and then we can get to the hotel but it's been a journey and um, someone doesn't want us to be here but we're here and we're gonna have fun <laughs> um, yeah so everyone in our group has made it on two of the other ladies uh, already made it off onto another bus but apparently they only have two buses that are making loops to pick everyone up in this plane which there's hundreds and hundreds of people so that's I feel bad for anyone else who's like still on the plane and still towards the back but um, at least we made it here safely and, uh, right now it's like raining it's also messing up the process because um, that's I think part of the reason why we got delayed but um, hopefully it, the weather lets up and we have a good time we're gonna have a good time regardless so we're here <laughs> Fatherhood Chronicles. I just woke up literally like five minutes ago. And we'll chest hair all out. Um, and about to. Olivia's up, so I'm about to get her bottle and stuff ready. But uh, yeah, so day two of Fatherhood Only. Mama's gone in Barcelona. She texted us around um, 4 a.m. So 4 a.m. our time. And apparently her plane had to land in Madrid because it ran out of gas. So stupid. <laughs> That's dumb. Um, but it's Delta, so you know they're known for doing dumb things. Um, no shade. But uh, yeah. but yeah, good morning, day two. Today I'm not gonna vlog as much because I actually still have to go to work, um, even though the kids are off for teachers in service. Um, and my mom was gonna watch them all day. And plus I'm doing a staff, um, outing because it's the new school year for my staff and I'm treating them to happy hour right after work. So um, and shout out to the Cheesecake Factory for having like dope happy hours specials and whatnot, like super dope. And I don't like to do free advertising, but um, especially for like big corporations, but like um, their happy hours are super dope. So if there's like a Cheesecake Factory near you and you want to do like a cool happy hour 
with you know your friends or your staff or your team or something like that cheesecake is, is the wave um it's the move so definitely check out cheesecake but yeah let me go ahead and get this out already Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Oh, uh, you smell like all duty. Let me change your booty. Cause you smell like all duty. Let me change your booty. Cause you smell like all duty. hotel made um what did we do we went to go get some food after we uh, made it to our hotel because we couldn't check in until two um so there was like a restaurant not too far away um the food was really good it was more like a tapas which i heard that there's a lot of here um a lot of seafood type of food um it was really delicious like very light but good um so we went and did that and then finally we were able to check into our hotel and we all passed out so because of the time difference and how long we were on the plane and just all of that stuff and just being exhausted from really being up for the past night before um we all took a good 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 nap uh, we all showered and then napped so we all got dressed and i'm waiting in the lobby for the girls to get here so that we can um go hit the town i think the plan is because some of us still need some things um, we are gonna go find a mall. So we're gonna go check out a mall that one of us looked up and was able to find. Um, and then we are going to, I think after that go to, I'm gonna say it wrong, but I'll tell you guys when we're on our way there, but basically like one of the main streets in the city um, where there's like restaurant shops um, and then even like a little bit further up the street, there'll be some nightlife. Um, so super excited for that, finally in Barcelona and feel like I'm in Barcelona um, because for a while it was like I want to see more than the airport um, but we are here so excited I'm in the, the lobby of the hotel um, sometime probably tomorrow I'll do a little room tour um, it's just a small hotel room it's nothing glamorous or pretty um, I'm sorry really glamorous or extra about it um, but it's nice it is really nice though I'm excited about that um, and the bathroom is really nice and big so we are here getting ready to hit the town
Yes. Okay. okay. So look, she's <laughs> Yeah, so this place around here, people only come for the dinner and for the drinks. And after all the nightlife, is down to the harbour at the Port Olympic. Okay, uh, by there you have four bus nightclubs of Barcelona. And the clubs name Opium, then you have Pasha, then you have Shoko, and you have Catwalk. Okay, four of them, they all together. And as you told me, you're from Philadelphia, so I, I'm working for someone here, so I have experience. The people like from Philadelphia, they would love to go for a music, hip hop, or and guitar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Everything is a package for only twenty dollars. Oh, we're gone. Oh, we're we're yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. Euros. Euros, yeah. yeah, twenty let's euros. Because I was like. Yeah. No, no, I'm sorry. Yeah. 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 But yeah. one cocktail yeah. and two shots, and you, you can choose the cocktail, mojito, sex on the beach, vodka, whiskey, gin, tonic. All right, do I follow you? But apart from that, he is speaking my language. I'll get an extra glass of champagne for free in my bar. Do we follow you now? Exactly. We follow you now. I love that. Okay, let's follow you now.